Hi girls at the corner. This is Terry Barr from Westside Church up in Northern California and our church partners with 614 Church in Columbus, Ohio. So thank you, Kathy, for inviting me to share for a couple minutes uh, to your ladies. And I want to encourage you girls that um, ah, there is hope <laughs> in Jesus. Uh, we've been through so much. These are crazy times from the pandemic to the lockdown to uh, the horrible racial injustice and murder and response and violence and looting and rioting and all of it. It's just um, a crazy, crazy mess. And, uh, you know, we don't wrestle against flesh and blood, but powers and principalities in high places. And so it's not against our brothers and sisters that we would be angry, but it's against the enemy that wants to steal, kill and destroy. And I believe that there uh, is a lot of evil behind all that is taking place all around our world. However you get your information, um, there's plenty of it out there. So you could be talking, two people could be talking to each other and one has uh, one source of information or several sources on one side and the other has several sources on the other side and they don't meet and which causes for a lot of division right now, even in the body of Christ. Um, I want to encourage you to get your information and your input more than anything else from the Word of God and from the counsel and guidance of the Holy Spirit. You know, when Jesus ascended into heaven, he says, I'm going to leave a comforter with you. I'm going to leave you the Holy Spirit to bring guidance and counsel and to teach you and to comfort you and bring you peace and all the things that we need. And we can go to him at any time, all the time, and be consciously aware of his presence. And, you know, God is intimate with us. He knows us more than we know ourselves. But for us to get intimate with God, we need to get close to him. We need to talk to him. We need to cry out to him. We need to say, God, I don't understand. Would you help me? And we need to reach out to Him it, through His Word and through His Holy Spirit. And He is always there. Tim Keller uh, wrote this quote. Um, he said, Let me practice your presence all day. Then I will not give in to foolish lines of inner self-talk that only darken my heart. When we are only looking at all the information out there on social media and listening to all the news and, and all the things, we can get so discouraged, we can get angry at our fellow brothers and sisters, um, but we want to speak what Jesus speaks. We want to represent him. And Romans uh, 12, starting with nine, verse nine, it says, Love must be sincere, hate what is evil, cling to what is good, be devoted to one another in brotherly love, honor one another above yourselves. Let's love each other. Let's love every color, every race, every kindred, every tribe. Let's love God with all our hearts and love others as he's told us to do and love ourselves as well. God bless you. I love you. And there is hope.